It turns out that if I show you something that's familiar to you versus unfamiliar, your brain will have a different unconscious response. So imagine I show you something like a strange little 3D statue of a Pokemon. So if it's the first time you've ever seen that statue, your brain has a different response to it than if it's something you've seen before. So the police or the private investigator can leverage the guilty knowledge technique because let's say they know that this unique little statue of the Pokemon was at the scene of the crime. It was on the desk of the man who got murdered. So they sit you down in the chair and they put the polygraph electrodes on your skin and then they show you a can of Coke and then they show you a computer printer and then they show you a large spoon and then they show you the Pokemon statue. Woo, big response. <laughs>